Nat 20. Welcome back to A Deal with Demons, where in our previous episode, Farron vanished. And the rest of the crew went to uh, Deepwater Lake in order to investigate some monsters that had reportedly been killing everyone in that lake. So they found out that there was a water elemental and a plesiosaurus in that lake. So they eventually made it to an a small island near where the monsters were killed them. And then they found they were still being attacked by something. So they investigated the island and they found out that underneath was a la was a mind player's lair. So that's where we left off. And I will start with Farron. Mm. So Farron, uh, this is about a day back, just to, to be caught up. So right now you're still asleep in the inn that you guys were staying at after the party in Haria. <clears throat> okay. And you're dreaming. So you're dreaming of just like a normal dream, and then <clears throat> the, that dream slips away, and you slip into dream. And as you look around, everything is black around you, except you can see three figures. You can see one demon-like fig demon or devil-like figure in front of you by about 20 or 30 feet who you have seen before, who you may have made a deal with at another point, and whom you had seen in Stillsby. Then, to your right, you see a Kenku. Roll a uh, history check, please. Oh my god. That's 11. You recognize this Kenku. This is Killable Kyle the Kenku. <laughs> Great, another NPC come back. And then <laughs> to your left, you see a Shardana. He has long silver hair, no facial hair, and he, he looks swole and buff as fuck. Roll another history check on this one. Ah, uh, yeah, just three roll. Yeah. Thirteen. You recognize this is Artemis. <clears throat> and then... That was going to be Jonathan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, Jonathan, yeah. <laughs> no, you recognize this is Jonathan. <laughs> and then you hear the devilish demon figure in front of you laughing, like a maniacal evil laugh. And you hear on each side of you, the other two are screaming and their eyes have turned white. And then... Uh, you also see that they're in chains, and when you look down, you are too. Uh, then the stream starts to fade. And do you see nothing anymore? You open your eyes, and you're in the center of the room that you were in before, in the inn. And you still see uh, Ryan sleeping in the other bed. And then you blink, and... You are not there anymore. You have a vision. It's a, it's a flashback. You you seem to be reliving what happened to you when you uh, first came to Silsby. <clears throat> exact same thing. So you, you at first were making that the deal you made. And then you see the devilish figure again. Uh... Then he takes you to an empty wheat field, and you vanish again into a decrepit and evil land. You see no vegetation, nor any rocks and flames. And then you hear him chanting and chanting and chanting. It seems to be coming from more than one voice. And he seems to be surrounding you with multiple copies of himself. Then you feel drained and tired. Have no, no longer have any energy and you feel weak. The chanting continues until you fall to your knees and you fall unconscious. Then you wake up and you look around you. You're on a, <laughs> uh, you're on a mountain. There's snow around you, but there's about a 50 foot radius circle around you where there's no vegetation, no snow, no grass or anything like that. And then you see about 50 different people looking downcast, energy drained, and in chains. And then... 
then you start to hear the chanting again. You don't see the devil, devil, devil man anymore. You feel your skin burning and burning and burning until it's almost unbearable and you start to scream. And I'll go to the other crew right now. <laughs> really? Because it's a roller coaster. <clears throat> Alright, I'm in purgatory, so. You have too many visions, I thought we were in that so raven. <laughs> you wake up in a cart. <laughs> Your hands are bound. <laughs> Yo. Uh, so, Yo. the rest of you guys are underneath an island looking in into the island, and you see a mind flare and a slayer. Uh, I think Zach was in the lead. He was yeah. in front of everyone. Uh, what will you guys do? Run away. Turn around, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is enough. I'm about to add up. Uh, I don't know. You're kind of taking the charge on this one there, Lazarus. Big old guy. Uh, Where's the see fucking mass there? Layer in there? <laughs> uh, so from your viewpoint, uh, you see the mi- a mind flare is to the... Uh, northeast of the room, and he's facing you guys. And beside him, about five, ten feet, there's a large pedestal with another pedestal on top of it, kind of. And then in that pedestal, in like a glass encampment, encampment is that casement? Encasement, thank you. You see an emerald. And then all around the room, you see mirrors. And as you look in the mirrors, you see the outside. Everything that's happening above the water. Oh, he's got like a dope observatory. That's cool. And right. you see behind the mind player, you see his bed, and you see a bunch of bookcases, and there's one shelf that has multiple brains still in it huh. in encasements. Welcome to my lair. <laughs> These are my seven <laughs> shelves. <laughs> uh, how far away is he? Uh, he is. Around 30, 40 feet away. Does he see us? He does. Guys, there's a fucking mind flare in there! <laughs> I'm just gonna charge at him. Fuck! The negotiations have failed! The negotiations were cut short. That was good. That was good. I mean, this guy was in my mind. I'm not. I'm not okay with that. So, I'll. I'll run up like 10 feet and then I'll. This, this man is suspicious. <laughs> I'll throw my two uh, short swords at him. Okay, sure. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Sexy. Where are you running? 10 feet towards him. Uh, actually, I'll use a bonus action to put Hunter's Mark on him. And okay. then I'll throw my short swords. Ooh. That's good. That's a 21 and a 26. Yeah, both hit. Wow. 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 Dirty 20 and a 25. I'm sorry. Oh, (laughs) wow. So (laughs) many. Ooh, I don't know if that's going to hit. Okay. (laughs) Suddenly I've changed my mind. You suck. (laughs) Yo, I thought we were on the same team. Oh, yeah, I got to remember to change my my thing to a D8 for my damage. So. It's 12, 17. 17 damage? Yeah. Okay. Good job, Lazarus. Yeah, so you threw <laughs> both your swords at him, and one hits him right in the shoulder, and the other hits him, like, just on the gut. Okay. But he, he kind of moves with Yo. it and kind of takes it and then starts moving towards you. Are we still in initiative? Yes. Oh, we're okay. in the same initiative that you guys were in before. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yo, this kind of reminds me of the beginning of Endgame with Thanos just chilling at home. <laughs> I'm just it's been out for a while, man. Yeah, I know. Why you're gonna spoil it? I know. Reminds me of that though, where he's just, you know, this guy's just probably chilling. We're all just running, and Zach runs. He's like, <laughs> 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 oh my god, the stones. Us <laughs> <laughs> next will be Blaze. Ooh, Destiny. Um, I'm almost out of darts. And I don't mean cigarettes. <laughs> I, I, I use the mines to destroy the mines. <laughs> that makes no sense! <laughs> Good one, that. You're a fucking idiot! Um, well, now I'm not worried about my daggers, like, disappearing into the ocean. Uh, I, or, like, I'm gonna whip my diamond dagger and my obsidian dagger at him. Okay. So, whip it. Whip, whip it, it real good. <laughs> yeah, because that's my action and my bonus section. 
Okay, that's good. That's oh, same one. Uh, plus six, so twenty-five, twenty-five. Yeah, both hitch. All right. You got uh, yeah. doubles. I mean, you get to roll again. <laughs> 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 Does anyone have a player's handbook? So I want to see if I can. Uh, if uh, I, do. I think technically a dagger counts as a monk weapon now for me, so I want to make sure I can. Uh, Does anyone have a player's handbook and three of them fly across the room? <laughs> oh my face! <laughs> Sorry, I I forget. Hey, you can you pass my... the Capri Sun. <laughs> <laughs> you quiet over there. You piss me off. <laughs> that was a good reference, actually. Uh, I just want to make sure. I'm proud of it. I didn't get it. Oh, uh, you can roll d4 and place normal damage on a strike or a monk weapon. Just re enact it. Have you seen that video? There's that guy, he's like, who can you piss the Capri Sun in? And the sun shocks like a whole, like. Would a dagger count as my monk weapon? Capri Sun at his face. Uh, I have to say that again. again. Uh, uh, would a dagger count as a monk weapon for me? Yeah. Uh, what does it say about monk weapons? So I'm looking for right now. Monks don't use weapons because they uh, are Monks, peaceful. which are short swords and any simple melee weapons that don't have the two-handed or heavy property. Yeah, yes. Okay, cool. Then that means I can use a D8 instead of a D4. A little for a dagger? Yeah. Sorry, D6, not a D4. Yeah, fucking D8 no, for D8, a dagger. No, D8 I will get eventually. <laughs> yeah. But for now, it's still a D6. It's, I've been saying. rolling D4 for the last little while. That's a short sword. So, oh. No, a short sword is only D6. Well, yeah, I meant his D6. Ah. Five. Wow, doubles again! What the hell? Okay, so five plus one more time. So eight <laughs> plus four is twelve damage, and then the other one is six is ten damage. So twenty-two damage. Wait, that's no. Sorry, I don't have my dex to that. No, so just uh, now your dex to one. Yeah. Oh yeah. So yeah. so eight, twelve, and uh, six damage. Okay. So eighteen, 18 damage. Okay, still good. You should roll in two nat ones next. And then for my movement, I will just run in 20 feet this way. Okay. Uh, next is Xerthos. Uh, oh, so, yeah. you will... Uh, I'm just going to sing a song about this. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's like, yo, this is good song material. Fuck, I didn't write down a spell, so... <laughs> you will... Oh yeah, Lovecraft is here, right? Nope, no, no, he's on an island. That's right, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. I knew he was good. But he was, the, he's there. <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely somewhere that we did not forget about. It. He is there. Uh, he'll use uh, Aldrich Blast, I think. <gasps> yeah, he will. Okay. It's a D10, right? Could be. He misses. <laughs> By Yay! Lock. He ends up, those. like, setting the beam at him, and then <laughs> it actually hits one of the brains that's on display behind him. Damn. It just blows it up, like, it's just in, pe- in like, small pieces now. Nice. Wow. And then it is Aelrindal. It's big brain time. <laughs> 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 um, <laughs> so, were we all, like, in the general... Area coming through, or yeah. am I like actually? No, you're all in okay. the area coming okay, through. Cool. Um, so question about my destination dagger. Yeah. Um, so throwing it as an action, teleporting to it is that an action or is that a bonus action? Bonus action. Yeah. So throwing as an action, teleporting. Yeah, I guess a bonus act. Like, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It has to be a bonus action. Yeah. You did buy that dagger. You have to be attuned to it though, which you are not yet. Yeah. Well, now's the time to figure that out. <laughs> Doesn't it take like two days? Something like that. Just a short rest. Just a short rest. Just a short rest. I think it's more than just one. Oh, we can look it up later. The important part is you're not. <clears throat> so, when I, if I was to teleport with it, that'd be like a disadvantage or something? Or you how did, would that work? You wouldn't be able to use it. Yeah, no. you wouldn't be able to use okay, it. Okay, that's yeah. fine. Um, I wasn't going to use it anyway. Yeah. Let's go. I guess I'll. Come in through the doorway. Um, I will. How many feet approximately is he away right now? It's about around forty-five. Forty-five. Okay, I'm gonna move like twenty feet, kind of towards him. Okay. I'm that one. Oh, sorry. No, it's okay. So like right there. Uh, yeah. yeah, and then I'm gonna shoot my longbow at him. Ooh, uh, twelve. That misses. Okay. Almost. Well, you know. And, and you have two attacks as That's a... That's true, yeah. 
Spider. Uh, I'm gonna do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, man. I keep forgetting. I just. I forget a lot of shit. Oh no, that's right. I do have extra seven. seven. No, no, okay. So okay. this one again hits another brain, and that actually seems to really piss off this mind player. That was oh. my one. <laughs> <laughs> Those were my favorite brains. Uh, anything else you want to do? No. That was the end of big brain time. Uh, it is this mind player's turn. Yo, everybody has better initiative than me. Ro ready. He is going to use mind blast because it just finished recharging. Exactly. And I'm not being like, because it just finished recharging, it actually that I was keeping track of it last time. Sure you were. You did. Uh, so can uh, everyone do a intelligence saving throw? Ooh, absolutely. You need, yeah, to, you need to beat a 15. Oh, I got a 19 plus whatever. So I'm on a mountain being screamed at. <laughs> no! You have disadvantage. This I is rolled a an 8. Moment. That's my jam, too, and I rolled an 16, 18. 16, 19. 19. I failed. Okay, <laughs> no. Fuck this guy. Okay, so you will take. Uh, where's my deeds? Could have gone better. Uh, you'll take 21 psychic damage. 21? Yeah, and the two of you are stunned for one minute. Can uh, I borrow the cloth? <laughs> that's, a, that's such a bro moment. Tony, can I borrow the cloth? Uh, dude, this is why I brought the tissue. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I'm almost dead. Sick. Yeah, I'll take one. That was like almost half my fucking life. No, that was. It's cool I got this. The good news is that I haven't taken damage like since last session. I've been managing to avoid that. Yeah, 21. Yeah, I don't think I've, yeah, I don't think I've taken any damage either. But I'm stunned. <clears throat> That's not baller. <laughs> and then Stunning. Ryan. Okay, I, you, uh, okay. <laughs> Is the Mind Flayer wearing anything metal? Uh, he's wearing breastplate. I cast heat metal on the breastplate. Okay. Nice. Does he have to do a saving throw of any kind? Uh, no, I think it just affects him. And then... Do you have to touch it to heat it no, up? No, it's 60 okay. feet range. Okay. Ryan, what are you wearing right now? <laughs> <laughs> Stop it, we're fighting! <laughs> Anything I can see within range. Okay. Um, 2d8 fire damage until the spell ends. The creature must succeed on a con saving throw or drop the object. And if it can't drop the object, it just has disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks until the start of my next turn. So. Yo. It's pretty good. Anyway, 2d8 fire damage. It's, uh, this one. So con saving throw first? No, after. Or, uh, after? Okay. On this turn? No, it can it have a good damage, but after yeah. that, it would oh, okay. just be half damage. Right? It's a solid three damage. three damage. No, it's not half damage. It does full damage. Pretty few. Okay, and then if the creature is holding wearing the object and takes damage from it, the creature must succeed on a con save or drop the object. If it can't drop the object, it has disadvantage on attack rolls and ability checks. Oh, okay. So okay. actually, even if he did save, he's still wearing it. Yeah, so he wouldn't be able to really get it off. No. It would no. take an action first. Yeah. Something. Actually, no, but for armor, the, it takes an action to take off. Yeah. But con save would be to like withstand the heat. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. So you would just take like. Is it like a. Take half half it doesn't take half. It's He has disadvantage on attack rolls okay. and ability checks. Oh, okay. He got a 10 on a con save anyway. Okay. So it's minus. like a 15 or a 17 or something. It's a 25. It's a 25 con save. You're a cleric. Your thing is definitely more than 10. So how much damage is <laughs> that? Three. Three? Because okay. I roll like ass. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> Can't stand the heat. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Idle name. <laughs> okay. So I will go back to fair. That's why I was having fun. Yeah. I don't like it. So you <laughs> see these people all around you in this fifty-foot radius who are all looking weakened and have chains on and looking downcast and everything like that. Uh, you assume they were used. They were prisoners of some kind. And, yeah, so, you then hear the chant in it again from this devil-like figure. You can't see him anywhere. You hear him chanting, and then some laughing at the same time with the chanting. It seems to be coming from all around you. And your skin's burning and burning up, and you feel as though there are scales, like, coming out on your skin. Uh, roll a con save, please. <laughs> Uh, eight. <laughs> uh, 
your senses are beginning to fade, like your your vision's fading, your hearing's fading, although you can still hear all the chatting in your head. And, uh, you know, all of your senses are fading and then you black out. And uh, a while later you wake up and all around you everything is just burnt. You don't see anyone there, you don't see... You don't hear the chanting anymore or hear anything. This is a lot like what happened the first time after you made the deal. And then uh, back uh, before you guys went to the depths. Uh, so you now wake up and you see scales on your arms that are start slowly starting to fade away. This is the last time I decide to sleep. <laughs> So I'm back in like the, the the room. No, you're on this mountain. So I'm on the mountain yeah. still. I'm on a mountain right now. Oh damn, that's cool. Okay, uh, keep up. okay I'm gonna. How's the mountain look? Like, what's uh, the scene? Roll a perception check. Okay. Nat twenty. Okay, so you see everything. Uh, this <laughs> isn't at all one of the biggest mountains, but it, and you're not. At the top of it, you're at one section where it kind of flats out for a little bit until it goes back down. You see a path in the distance that's going between two mountains, and far, far in the distance, you can th- you think you can see a city. Uh, roll a well, actually, you're not from this plane of existence, right? I don't think so. No. Yeah. So you wouldn't <laughs> know what this town would be. Uh, well, that's comfort. You do see far off, far off in the distance going south that the mountains seem to be like decreasing in size. And right now you also hear the fading away of the sound of wings of the dragon. You don't see a dragon anywhere, but you hear it. Well, I guess this is where my journey begins. Good you uh, yeah, I'll start going through the, down the path, making my way to that okay. city. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, so you, uh, can, you start going down this path, and it is a bit treacherous right now, cause you're, like, there is no actual path to that path, so you're just kind of climbing down the mountain. And there's, it is a snow covered mountain, so it is a bit rough getting there and really cold. Oh. <laughs> we come around the mountain when he goes. Uh, and. You don't see any other signs of boot prints anywhere around here, but you are able to like you are able to like find your way towards the path. It'll just take a while. Okay. Is there anything else you want to do right now? Mostly just try and scan the area, see if I can figure out where I am. Okay. Uh, you keep an eye out for that dragon. Yeah, so you don't, again, you don't see the dragon anywhere. You can just barely faintly hear the sounds of, like, wings flapping off in the distance. It seems to be going further away. And, uh, you do know that, I guess you do know that the city of Ait is far in the mountains. So you could possibly assume that's where, what the city is that you saw. Okay. And do you assume that this mountain range is between where your friends were and probably between night? Alright, I'm just gonna write in my journal as I travel. I'm the- Yo, what if you just got dropped off on Everest, bro? <laughs> Dude, I wouldn't be able to breathe. And you do see some streams running down from other mountains, from like glaciers and stuff like that. Going Water to- streams? Yeah. Make sure. No, it's just ranch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll go back to the rest of you guys now. Bring it on, you stupid fuck! So that was... <laughs> uh, Bring it on! Uh, so hey. you are stunned right now. So yes, please I roll another intelligence check. I kind of don't want Blaze to ever go back to being... <laughs> like, your voice for that is just... Good. I think it'd be 15, right? Yep. I don't. Okay. You're still stunned. All of us have to do this? No, uh, oh, just a human place. So, Blaze, you're up, so please yeah, roll in and you can see Yeah, yeah. It's the only roll to attack. Uh, 17. That's yeah, you are no yeah. longer stunned. Yeah. That's my turn? Yeah. Okay, can I use, uh, 
Can I just flip them off? <laughs> oh, I can only use one hand. One hand's a mouth. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to flip them off one hand. The other one's going to be like, fuck you! <laughs> okay. Read my lips, asshole! <laughs> we really just, just hopped in here. Just yeah. Full, full force. Yeah. Well, there's only one way in, and we were all going to fucking drown if we didn't go in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so Zerthos is next, so he'll try to use Aldrich Bass again. Hmm. Forgot that guy was in here. He failed. What is this guy here for? <clears throat> he was going to go to Ife with you guys. Because he had he's a gig there. He just used Aldrich Blast. He missed, missed twice. Yeah, I know, but he's been trying. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> What'd you do? He pedal? <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, now he has disadvantage on his eye rolls. So, so yeah. Hell yeah. Hell All yeah. Right. yeah. Um... I'm gonna run up to this dude and give him a big hug. No, just okay. fucking tackle. Him. We're sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't kill me. <laughs> I forgive you. No, I'm gonna hit him with my long sword. <gasps> uh, I'm gonna use this guy. This guy won't betray me. Yeah, betrays you. That one. one. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's good. Uh, Twenty-three. Yeah, definitely. It's nice. Uh, Chop those fucking tentacles off, man. I will Gross. cut off his tentacle beard. Uh, that is nine damage. Nine? Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to like go, I'm going to kind of charge in, and I'm going to swing my longsword around and cut him across like the stomach. Nice. And then I'm going to spin around again, kind of like um, Link from Smash Bros. <laughs> See, I thought you were about to do something cool, then you ruined it. Link no. actually isn't from Smash Bros. <laughs> <laughs> I said that purposely. Oh, okay. Go on purposely. Well, <clears throat> I don't believe you. Link from Super Smash Bros. Melee. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'm going to take that roll. Uh, <laughs> yes. All right. Uh, I'm going to hit him again with my longsword. Yeah. So uh, that's so 25. Yeah, definitely hits. So okay. the next time you flop your roll, you have to take it, even if it's like a two. That's okay. I'm holding you accountable. It's, <laughs> it's definitely going to happen. I'm going to be about it. Uh, that is a five. Five. It's a two, you fucking liar. Well... <laughs> <laughs> in the end, yeah. So I just like swing around twice, and then at the second card, I kind of do it downward and I bring my sword down. And I'm okay. Ready to attack again. Uh, so next, he will use. Uh, he'll use tentacles on you, Ryan. Alright, bring it on. He has disadvantage on attack. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he misses. Damn, you could have. What was he doing? Tentacles. How does, what is, what even oh! <laughs> Is he close enough for that? He would have walked up to him. Okay. Or I guess. Wait. So which one is this? Either? No, this. That's La- That's yeah, Lazarus. This right is. Here. Oh okay. fuck! I would have. He would have uh, attacked me. Lazarus. Yeah. Yeah. Me, Ryan. yeah. He was going to attack you then, oh. but he missed. Okay. Uh, so next is Ryan. Uh, All right. Uh, I'm going to walk up to him. I What's your moving speed? <laughs> oh. I'm going to walk up most of the way to him. <laughs> Can't quite get there. Give him a big smooch. And I'm going to be like, fuck you, Davy Jones looking bastard, and I'm going to cast Guided Bolt on him. Does Heat Metal need <laughs> concentration? Okay, I was going to ask. Heat Metal is concentration, but Guided Bolt isn't. So you can't cast another can't spell cast another when spell. you're concentrating. No. Okay. I you? thought it was two concentration spells. You could, it is might it? be. Uh, I thought you could cast <clears> one that doesn't... If it's not concentration, it doesn't break your concentration. Yeah, I yeah, I, I think that's right. Let me. Okay. I can look for it. Just punch him. We'll be right back after this short break. Yeah. Yeah. Punch him in the dick. Do my players have dicks? I don't know. Some spells can? require to maintain concentration or keep their magic. If you lose concentration, such such a spell mm-hmm. ends. If a spell must be maintained with concentration, that fact appears in its duration entry and the spell specifies blah blah blah. You can end concentration blah blah blah. Normal activity such as moving, attacking doesn't interfere with concentration. Uh, casting another spell that requires concentration will break it. Taking damage can break it. Yeah. Being incapacitated or killed can break it. Okay, but so that's it. A spell that doesn't require concentration. Yeah, it's pretty golden. Okay. You can cast it. Um, <clears throat> can you look up if mind flares have dicks? <laughs> <laughs> they do, Tony. Nice. He knows because he's seen one. It was horrible. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> so when they mate, is it like cuttlefish? Can we continue <laughs> <Where they match? laughs> with the battle? Yeah, uh, sound- <laughs> Sounds like a bomb. Yes, that's, that's why he doesn't want you to. <laughs> that's why he doesn't want you to uh, get those brains because they contain the memories of all the times he's made it, and he doesn't want people to know that mind players have dicks. Very we must destroy the brains. <clears throat> I think we should just destroy. It's like his search players. history. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All the brains. It's big, it's big brain time. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna cast guiding bolt on him. Okay, and I roll eleven plus seven. Or 11. sorry, plus 18. eight, so 19. Oh, 19, yeah, it hits. Sweet, okay. 
Guiding bolt. Plus 46. Plus 8? Yeah. Yo, that's, that's yeah. timpin. I have a good spell attack bonus. Oh my god, okay, 11, 12, 16 damage. <clears throat> 16? And as my bonus action, I'm gonna maintain heat metal. So he has to make another con save, and I do 98 damage. You failed. Sick. He has to be um, a 16. Okay, and I do 8 damage again. Or 8 more damage, I mean. So you heat this metal, and you, it's like glowing, like white hot now. And he's squirming and squirming and squirming, and then a tentacle hits the uh, plate and just sizzles. Another one hits, sizzles. Ooh, he's like, <laughs> <laughs> he's panicking and panicking and panicking, and eventually he just falls down. More like Kilomari. Wait, did he die? Woo! Woo! Oh, oh my god, god, I'm a badass. There's no way we kill him already. Yep. Holy shit! Holy shit! I guess I didn't do a fuck kind of damage in that. Yo, year. good job, buddy. And this five against of... one. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Maybe we should have oh. talked to him. No, <laughs> it was so fine. Say, he literally did twenty three damage. He tried to, to drop me. <laughs> yeah, he literally did twenty three damage. He tried to tentacle you. Yeah, dude, this guy had it out for and me. And he was sucking the brains out so of me. So am I no Ooh. longer stunned? Well, he's dead, so the concentration ends. It was. It's not concentration though. But I mean, if he's dead, the spell effect ends. Because the spell is no longer there. I mean, if you're stunned, are you just stunned until... Well, it, yeah. either, it has a duration, or you make the save. Yeah, it's a duration. One minute. It doesn't end, even if he dies. I'm going to wake up in a minute. We'll just yeah. do everything and not give him anything. No, that's fine. <laughs> uh, you're just stand still over there, Lazarus. I'm going to check out these brains. <laughs> not like I can do anything anyways. Yeah, I'm going to give him a little... Rub him on the head. I'm super short as a runner, so I'm just going to like jump up and like tap his head. And then I'm going to go check out those brains. I want to see what's uh, up with those fucking brains. Okay. They're right so, here, right? Yeah, I'm going back to fair now. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's, uh... All right. It was on the Emerald. Have fun, fair No, it's all checking out. Yeah, it's probably a trap. So Emerald's probably a trap. Yeah. Don't pick up gems. I know that. Yo, <laughs> what, if, what, if, what if it's the green Chaos Emerald? <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. That's true. It's not a fun one. Okay, anyway, anyways. So you're still trying to find your way towards the path. Yeah. Okay, uh, make a survival check, please. That's, that's a bro. Shut up, it's six. Six. Time uh, So snow has started to fall down and soon it turns into blizzard. No. And you have lost your way. You have no idea where the path is. You want to know which way is down the mountain and which way is up the mountain. I'm going to cast Gust of Wind and disperse this blizzard. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, dude, when you cast Gust of Wind, nothing goes right. <laughs> or no, too great. right. I don't yeah. know. Uh, yeah, so does Gust of Wind like, stay with you? It's, it's it? like a con- it's, it's a continuous cycle. I can't actually move. I just want to see it, get my bearings. Okay, are you able to like move it around? I can or? spin around. Oh, okay, so I can stay stationary, but I can move it around in a circle around me. But like you can't like walk. And... I can't walk and use it. Okay, I just want to get a better direction again. Now that I can't see it. Okay, so yeah, so you cast 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 wind. How much of a radius is it? Uh, it is. Fifteen feet. I, don't know, go I think it's thirty feet. by five. That sounds right. Thirty by five. Yeah. 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 It's not by five feet though. I think it's by ten feet. But yeah, thirty feet sounds better. Yes, yeah, so this helps a bit because the snow is lo- no longer in your face and just annoying you. So you're able to see that you are definitely going down the mountain, and you see that actually about twenty feet in front of you, there's a drop. <laughs> Just, just so you know, it's a line of strong wind, 60 feet long and 10 feet wide, and it blasts from you okay. uh, in a direction you choose. So, Yeah, so when you like direct it towards the bottom of the mountain, you do see that there's a drop-off, like right about 20 feet in front of you, where, like directly where you were walking to. Okay. And you're able to see that that drop-off ends after about 30 feet going to the right. Okay. And... Uh, yeah, you're still not able to actually see the path from where you are just because this blizzard is getting really bad. Yeah. Uh, but you are able to see somewhat the direction you think you should go. Like, by looking at where your 
food prints were before. Okay. So you knew where you were going before. Okay, I will disperse gust of wind. I will continue down the path. Carefully, I'll move slower and keep my eyes on the ground. Like going straight <laughs> or... Following where my footprints were going. Following that... Uh, going to the drop-off. Okay. Put it that way. Okay, so you know where the drop-off is. So yeah. you're, you get there and you you look down and you're just a- barely able to see that you don't actually see the mountain anymore. Uh, the drops off. Good, good. How far is this drop? Uh, it's about... Uh, it's probably about 50 feet. 50 feet. You can make that. So anything that uh, I can tie a rope to around me? Uh, there are a few small stones in the ground that are like jutting out, but that's real. You did see that you were able, you would be able to like go far enough to either side to go around it. I want to take my wooden stake and a hammer because I have all that. <laughs> and I'm going to take the stake, I'm going to use the hammer, pound it into the ground so it's secure. I'm going to take my 50 foot rope, I'm going to tie around <laughs> that stake, and I'm going to rappel down Yo, that drop. Okay. Fern's gonna kill himself, and we're never gonna see him again. We're gonna just gonna assume that he's left us. Uh, just roll either an athletics check or a survival check as you climb down. I'm gonna use survival. I got more points in that one. Uh, oh, dude, he dies. <laughs> Falls right off. Seven. Seven. Uh, so you start to pull down, you get about halfway down, and you, your grip starts to slip because of all the snow that's all around you. It's making everything slippery, and you're, like, freezing cold now because of all the snow and wind. That sucks. And I you lose your grip, oh, no. and you begin to fall. Oh, okay. good. Roll a dexterity saving throw. Shit. Hey! Yeah! That's Dirty good. 20! Yeah, so you fall about you free fall about ten feet, and then and you're just like grasping wherever you can to try to find a handhold or your rope again, and you find the rope with your right hand, oh, yeah. and, and you're able to hang on and just slow your descent enough that you slowly make it to the ground. Roll for the flash. <laughs> <laughs> well, that wasn't the most graceful of the pals, but it'll do. <sighs> All right, now I'm at the base. Uh, can I see anything else, or is the blizzard still uh, going strong? Uh, it's still going strong, but you do see that the uh, other side of the Strava, like going back to it, there's a cave inside. I don't like heading into dark places. Uh, Those are my favorite places. Okay, I will. I will head into the cave. Okay. I will do that. You have a dark vision ring, right? I do. Okay, you give one to me, yes. Yeah, so uh, as you walk into this cave, you don't see any monsters or anything else in this cave, but you do see that about 40 feet in, a landslide has uh, moved, uh, has uh, made rocks fall all throughout the cave, like cutting it off at one point. <sighs> so this is a dead end area? Yeah, and also roll another perception check. I don't see how this is going to all connect. Uh, it's natural nine. <laughs> uh, as you walk closer to the walls and just investigate this cave more, you do see that there are what almost seem like ancient cave paintings in this cave. Oh, okay. And this first one you see is cut off from the rubble. But on this half of the cave, you do see that it seems like a beautiful, like, almost godly, like, woman who has a staff that looks like it has two horns on top, as well as some other, like, magnificent-looking weapons with her. What as well as a, ca- a cape and, uh, like, a bow and arrow on her back and a few other things. And she looks like she's laying down in a hospital bed. And there's a guy <laughs> what about uh, the other painting that's kind of covered up? Can I uh, tell anything about it? Yeah, so the, you see that on this one wall, it's one in, one huge painting. And you see that the rubble just cuts off. Like, you can't see the rest on the other side of it. How, how big is this rubble? 
uh, the chunks. Like there are some chunks that are like ten feet by ten feet, and then others five feet by five feet. Some small chunks, but it goes from like the floor to the roof, and it seems like really dense. I want to cast Gust of Wind and see if I can push the rubble out of the way, at least more to tell what the painting is fully. Okay. Uh, let's see. Just trying to figure out what to roll for this. Like, it'd be a save it's and strength. throw. It's a strength, strength save and throw. throw. What, what does it have to be? 15. Okay. Because the, uh, these rocks are like so dense and yeah. there's so many of them, I'm going to roll with advantage. That's fair. Dion yeah, giving himself advantage. <laughs> well, <it's just> like <laughs> two nat ones and the spell rocks go away. This enemy is pretty tough and he had a well night's rest, so I'm going to give him advantage. <laughs> <laughs> He's actually really fond of like this terrain. Advantage. <laughs> it got a 17. Yeah, that's us. So you do see some of the small rocks all around start to like uh, blow away or blow to the sides, but it, everything is still standing as is. Mm, worth a shot. And I'll go back to everyone else now. Okay. Spicy. So you guys ever in... just wonder where the fuck Baron went? <laughs> Sometimes I wonder where he went. <laughs> Nothing <that> it matters. <laughs> I'm investigating the brains. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Uh, roll either a. Or roll a insight check. Insight check? Yes. Can I check out the... No. Or actually, you can roll investigation just to check them out, and then if you want, you can or roll insight. Check it yeah, okay, fine. Yeah. What is that? Oof. Uh, 12. Uh, you do see there, there are some chunks missing in these grains, as if they have had parts eaten from, from them. So the mind player has been eating them. Nothing I could really do with them, though, that probably... <laughs> Eat them. I don't know, like, maybe there's, like, some kind of value to them? Or... Uh, you also do see, if, like, you guys would have noticed a few, like, skeletons all throughout the room with their heads caved in as well. This guy eats people. He's very astute! <laughs> <laughs> it is clear that he's been feasting on these brains as form of nourishment. Luckily, we've dispatched this evil villain! <laughs> uh, and then I'm gonna make my way back to the others who I'm assuming are checking out the... The emerald, probably? Yeah. yeah or the mind flare. Actually, can I go to the mind flare and check his parts? Sure. I, uh, also, know. when you were at the brain, you would have probably assumed that these were, like, the best brains that he had, and he, like, kept them for, like, special occasions. Yeah, because like he was that. a collector, as my, uh, my dear cousin Al was. Uh, he had uh, so many weird rocks, I didn't understand that guy at all, but, uh, he collected brains, which I think is a little more sadistic. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna rummage through his pockets, please. <laughs> yeah, since you just checked the brains, I'm gonna go yeah, through some else, so that it's like, so you're not checking everything before yeah. everyone else. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Get the fuck, you stupid rudderkin. I'm saying I'm making my way to the yeah. fucking mine place. I'm making my way downtown, <laughs> walking fast. <laughs> Faces have passed, and I am homebound. Uh, so, what did either of you <laughs> like to do? <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm gonna get. Uh, do I have it? Can I just, like. I just wanna check it out, see if there's anything up with it. Uh, with what? The, the Emerald. The Emerald? The Chaos Emerald. Uh, <laughs> roll and in Canada check. Arcana check. In Canada sounds better. <laughs> <first thing. laughs> in Canada? It's a new stat. You, you can use it as a will stat. Yeah. It's brand new. Uh. That's a five, bro. Five? Magic. I just you believe that there's something magical about this stone, but you have no idea what it is. Okay. I got a five. Can so. I cast Detect Magic? Okay. Uh, what <laughs> exactly does magic. that okay. do? <clears throat> like, For the duration, you sense presence of magic within 30 feet of you. If you sense magic in this way, you can use your action to see a faint aura around any visible creature or object in the area that bears magic, and you learn its school of magic, if any. Can penetrate most barriers, but is blocked by one foot of stone, an inch of metal, a thin sheet of lead, or three feet of wood or dirt. Yeah, so you sense a like somewhat powerful magic coming from this emerald. From the emerald just... itself, not from the glass surrounding it. Uh, no, from the emerald itself. And I'm just gonna look at the types of magic to determine what it is. Uh... Am I still stunned in all this? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> can you make? Saves every Yeah, you, you can make a save right now if you want. I threw a dice already and I failed. Okay. <laughs> uh, 
I believe this is abjuration. Abjuration. Mm. Ooh. What does that mean? Uh, wait. I need to take the stone to Lord on. <laughs> abjuration is like a, one of the magic that blocks, banishes, or protects. Yeah. Yeah, so you you un, you understand that this is abjuration magic. Okay. And is the spell, like, on the emerald, or is it just the emerald itself that's magical? Or can I tell? Uh, that's a good question. Mm-hmm. Uh, you assume that it was cast initially on the emerald, mm-hmm. but now the emerald is radiating it out. Seems quite magical. You also you, de- that? you also detect yes. magic coming from all the mirrors all around you. The mirrors. Yeah. Well, that was obviously they were magical. I mean, they were yeah. seeing up atop the island. Oh. Yeah. So like yeah, as yeah. you look through all the mirrors, you see like above the water going out in that direction. Yo, we, we found the Justice it. League Center. The in four K. Why is the screen TV smart TV? You want to download some apps? Easy peasy. He changed his one to the football game. Four <laughs> MVP. <laughs> um, Why am I friends with you guys? I don't know. Uh, can I go to the mind player then? Yeah. Uh, so you're able to go to the mind player now. Okay. Um, Sorry. Were you gonna do something else? I, don't know. I gotta think about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> All these pre rolls from Zach make me sad. <laughs> so like two fours. You want one of us to roll for you? Or... <laughs> I don't know. I don't think that counts. Maybe someone can actually just help me. <laughs> no, you'll fix yourself. We're a good party. <laughs> I'm not wasting a spell on a problem that'll go away. By You're itself. a cleric. It'll fix it's itself. Called saving your spell slots. Duh. He's never there. Also, cleric, I might need some healing. Actually, I uh, I, I can sh- heal I you. Yeah, we can probably take a rest soon. <laughs> We're not on a time limit. We've killed the monsters. Actually, this would be a good place. Yeah, place. after yeah. I loot this dude, yeah, can I'm laying right down here? to that bed. <laughs> just make it home. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but yeah. Uh, so, on this mine there, know. you don't find any weapons or anything like that. You find a small pouch with a few, uh, like, magical components in it. So, just like a component pouch. Okay, dibs. <laughs> As well, you find a small pouch with about 20 gold pieces in it. Are you using so, a caster? Some small uh, brains. No. I've been, no. So why do you get the component pouch? Like, what kind of components do you mean? Like, for Magical casting components. spells or, like, tinkering stuff? For casting spells. Oh, never mind. I throw that at you. I don't care about oh. that. But I'll take the, the gold because I'm broke. Okay, I don't notice it and it just hits me. And as you reach into another <laughs> pocket, you, you feel something really slimy. And as you t- take your hand out, you notice that it's brains on your hand. He just keeps brains in his pocket. <laughs> this guy's a fucking slob. It's like a fucking jerky, but it's brain. <laughs> Yo, dude's just munching away. Uh, I, I'll say, yeah, nothing of importance aside from these component uh, materials that I throw at uh, Ryan. Okay. Catch! Okay, Hacker. I catch, or I, I do not catch it. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Uh, but yeah, um, is there anything else noteworthy in the room? Aside from, like, the brains and emerald uh first off it has now been a minute so you are now able to move around oh. yeah <laughs> because your Lazarus screaming <laughs> yeah. i let a, out a huge sigh as i can finally move and the first thing i do is i go up to the mind player and just fucking start kicking him <laughs> as, I, foot. as i pull out my short swords and put them away yeah so you kick and like it uh you kick and uh your foot kind of like like uh, gushes into his head because oh. it's like it's like uh, an octopus head, so it's kind of uh, squishy. squishy. Thanks for finding the word for me. Yeah, no problem. That's nasty, man. Yo, eat his brain, and, and then a, a tentacle the just twitches. Okay, eat his brain. I see him twitch, and I'll stomp on his head. Okay, Ooh, this, is, this is a good opportunity. Oh, sorry, it's a great opportunity. Perhaps we can uh, remove his tentacles. The only and, uh, one my head is my, myself. You think uh, a mind flare tentacles would fetch a nice price? For me. Perhaps we should take his brain, his whole head then. I think we should take his tentacles and make a fake beard. <laughs> well, if we just take the tentacles, no one will know that they're actually mind flare tentacles. So we should, if we're going to be super, uh, 
Thoreau, we should just chop off the head entirely, take it with us, and sell it. I don't know. I We're gonna get stomped on the head. Yeah. <laughs> Did We're you do any like visible damage? I don't know. You didn't do damage because you threw your two fort swords at him. We're gonna we're gonna travel for three days and then it's gonna be all rotten and gross. That's fair. I just suggested it. Good. I wasn't sure. I, I know we're low on funds. I say to Lazarus, I'm like, good thing you aim for the head. <laughs> nice throwback. Yeah. <laughs> That's two end game references. What do you guys think we should do? Should we rest here or should we leave? My throat is getting super sore. I, uh, <laughs> I think we should definitely rest because I don't have any spell slots left. Where are we I think it's a good place to rest. <clears throat> Where are we headed to anyway after this? That was We're a headed. little town, right? I right, 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 right. Oh, we were looking for uh, Zorhas' place. And, no, not Zorhas. What's his name? Zerathos. Zerathos. And then we're also looking for the wizard and also Mr. Mister. Who stole all this shit from his bro? Fucking Mr. Mister. Honestly, we don't need a wizard. Can we, I, uh, yeah, we do! <laughs> I talk to Zethros and I'm like, can we just call you Z? Z Man. Z Man. Uh, sure, I guess. Like, Zerthos isn't a hard name, but. Sure. Alright, Z Man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna make that way easier on everyone. Thank you. Um, no I, I'm gonna go lay down um, a bit of them. I just gotta talk to them. So I say to Ryan, um. Do you think it's safe that we can take the emerald out of there? I don't know. Let's try it. And I break the glass. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <clears throat> I'm under the blanket. Before the time. Yo, I'm... Yeah, that was that was good. Yeah. Uh, so which way are you mo- like? Are you moving after you take the emerald, or like moving anywhere, or? <laughs> That, this is our it's an abjuration magic, banishment magic. If you get sent to another realm, I'm not coming. Yeah, for so like, like, like how are you die. grabbing it, and what are you doing yeah, after you, you grab you it? I take my hammer, I break the glass. Yeah, and nothing then happens I just there. Grab the emerald. You should let me grab and it. inspect it. Okay, uh, you inspect it, and as you do that, you notice that uh, there is water at the very top uh. and top, like. Uh, northeast co- corner. Oh, oh, oh God. God. He's keeping this, the water out. This oh, makes so much All right, all right. But oh. it seems to have stopped there. S- hey, put that fucking stone back. <laughs> I lift the stone up. The water, like. Oh, this is there. awesome! It's an anti-water stone. Well, no, it's a barrier. Probably. Well, yeah, it's a block like yo. Fire all right, we should put it back for when we go see. If we're gonna rest, we should leave it, and then we'll take it with us when we go. I'm just gonna throw it as no, I'm not. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll, I'll just put it back in the pedestal. Okay. You should try saying chaos control with it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> stop, bro. But yeah, let's uh, let's take it with us when we leave, because uh, we have to pick up uh, Lovecraft just, on our way out too. We can just walk through the bottom of the lake with it. I'm That's actually that. such a good idea. Can we roll for treasure chests? Yo, so, like, what's the point of continuing this quest? You need to go pirates. Um, I'm down for searching this, uh, the seabed. Maybe we'll find some cool like, stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Let's do right. something totally opposite the DM plan for. <laughs> <laughs> Give us cool toys and we're going to play with them. <laughs> I do lay down on that bed, though, because I definitely need a rest. Uh, Roll a passive... Or what's your passive perception? 14. Yeah, well, it's probably, 14. It's probably... You notice a chest right behind the mirror that's beside the bed. So oh, like, what? Yeah, uh, the bed's right here. You're laying here. There's a the mirror there. And you see a chest right oh, there. Oh, you guys! I found something! And I'll go over to the chest and check for traps. I'm gonna walk over there. Okay, uh, you don't notice any tra- traps I'm of any walk kind. Over no, there too. okay, I will. <laughs> Is it locked? <laughs> nope. I open it. Inside, you see a lot of gold and silver and bronze pieces. Oh. And then the mimic like eats you. I nice. will. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I count it out. That's okay. how I rest. I'm gonna count it out and I'm gonna lay down in the bed. All together, you find 200 gold pieces, 750 silver pieces, 500 bronze pieces, and 50 electrum pieces. Yo, this guy, this okay. is his whole savings account. <laughs> okay, okay. You assume um, this is the gold he's taken from everyone he's killed. Uh, okay, so 200 split between four. What five, is that? 50 each. 50 each? Okay, so. Sorry, those, it's like, hey! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> <I'm sorry>. Fuck <laughs> you! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, can you lie to them and just tell them that there's less than there actually is? <laughs> Did he notice me open the chest? Oh, wait, I He's easy out. counting it. I <laughs> also called out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, my God. Fine. <laughs> Santos, so I'm gonna be honest. How many times did you hit the mind flare? <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, that's right. That's you a did it. Piece of so, ah, oh, you're gonna take a little discount. <laughs> <laughs> so I took hits. Did yeah. you hit the mind flare? Yeah. How many times? I hit it with my dagger twice. Okay. All right. Just asking. And you get two gold. 
<laughs> and I killed the plesiosaurus. <laughs> Yo. And the water elf. No, I didn't kill the water elf. It's not always about the end, it's about the journey getting there. Okay, but <laughs> the point is. It's about the frenzy being along the way. <laughs> okay, fine. 200 divided by 5. 40. 40 each? Yeah. 40 gold? Bullshit. I will take that. Okay. I'll just take all the electrum. So that's 60 gold. No, you won't. Okay, how much uh, silver was there? 750. Uh, divided by 5. Okay, none of us know. <laughs> uh, it's it's one fifty. Can you get that? Can you yeah, get that silence out so it doesn't make it one fifty? <laughs> how much? Silence. How much copper is it? How much? How many silver was uh, it? Uh, one fifty each. Right. One fifty silver. Copper. Copper. Yeah. There's five hundred. You said. Yeah. So one hundred each. One each. Yeah. One hundred. And how much? Are you sure about that. Electrum was it? It was fifty electrum altogether, right? Yeah. So ten each. What is the electrum worth anyway? Can it's half a half a gold piece, isn't it? Is it half a gold piece? Uh, I can't remember. I'm sorry, right there. One fifty. Yeah, it's half a gold piece. Okay. Okay, so. And then how much? Realistically, I just uh, got uh, uh, five electro. Five gold pieces. Electro, yeah. Half so it's ten each. I pocketed yeah. off that mind flare. Hell yeah. Also, as soon as we've done that, I'm going to drag the mind flare's body out into the water. Okay. <laughs> Why? Toss it out. Okay. Kay. I was going to study it. Dude, wait, did we? Did we actually take his head, or is it no, 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 no. smash it? Uh, when he's doing that, I, I'm like, wait, stop, please, let me take notes first. I'm to stop dragging it. Okay, okay, <laughs> and I'm going to, I'm going to take some notes on him. It's a monster I've never encountered before, so I'm going to draw a picture. Um, so I'm going to, I'm going to paint a picture of the dead mind flare, uh, and I'm going to take some notes about its anatomy and its my, its uh, move set. That's 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 okay. literally I'm my character. I'm waiting to do something, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, after I, I stop, but it's just after I'm done, you can have him. Ah, just let me take some notes really quick. Be a little quicker, and it won't take you long. And then you can—he's all yours, okay? Sorry. He's just standing up. Like, it's for my—it's for my book, please. I thought you can say it's for my mom. <laughs> <laughs> it's for my <laughs> uncle Al. <laughs> that I'll, weird. I'll just leave the body to you then. Uh, okay, that sounds good. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna paint a picture. Is there anything? Else in this layer that's worth that's rule investigation. <clears throat> yes, sir. Yeah, I want to check out the mirrors and see if I can figure out how they that's are. an eleven. Eleven. Uh, you're not able to find anything else of significance besides the mirrors. Uh, you believe that there's some kind of uh, what kind of magic would this be? It would be a blue kind. Blue kind of magic. Yo, fair and more like fair gone. More like Ferris. Uh, illusion, magic. illusion magic. Far yeah. gone. Doesn't too far gone. Are you mad, man? <laughs> There's not really any real way we can make these ma- these mirrors, you know, work for us, can it? Rule and arcana check. You find the TV we're <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that's good. Shaw Ralton. Next Nineteen. Edit. Nineteen. Uh, you believe there would be a way to uh, change where these mirrors are aimed towards? Oh, You're not sure exactly how at this moment, but you believe that you could figure out figure it out eventually. So how they're like the mirrors? scrying mirrors. Uh, each one is about between five and ten feet long. So and about like. Four feet high. So they're not going to fit in the bag of holding. Alright. Dude, well. just like shoot them and then we'll, and then it'll be like the mummy where Brendan Fraser shoots a mirror and then all the mirrors just. You're turn not and here. A bunch of <laughs> You're not present. <laughs> yeah, what? You're <laughs> on a mountain. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm just making a reference. <laughs> Yo, sorry, I've only, I had to say. I've only seen the new one with Tom Cruise, the, no. which is the original, right? No, that's a terrible one. No, yeah. I heard it. I actually watched it just last night. Shut it's up, it's there. terrible. Yeah, you yeah, fucking idiot. No one cares about your opinion. <laughs> right, so anyway, uh, <laughs> I'm going to roll for the mummy to see how my opinion yeah. came out, you dinks. It's a pl- I have a plus three performance. So 15. Mm. Is it your Republican hand, your dominant hand, or like. Uh, it, the, the mouth hand is my left hand. You know, okay. And, uh, uh, I'm right handed. Okay. Bla- Blaze is right in. Pretty sure that's wrong. No, it's not. Okay. What the fuck? I'll decide. I was just asking. Jesus. Yeah, so you're able to make a decent painting of this. Uh, right there. And then I just, uh, I kick him out the door into the water. Okay. I'm gonna ask if anyone has any alcohol. 
I need to clear my mind a bit. Sounds like alcoholism to me! Ha! <laughs> ah! Uh, Xerthos hands you a, uh, wineskin. I'll chug down half of it. Fucking, <laughs> fucking bards! <laughs> <laughs> and as I'm drinking, I'm just going to, like, walk over to one of the mirrors and kind of lay my hand on it. Okay. See if it does anything. Uh, it does not. Okay. Now you just look depressed. <laughs> <laughs> you're, like, sitting on the mirror, like, looking down. Um... What are you guys looking at? <laughs> uh, yes, but, okay, for real now, I'm going to lay down and rest in the bed. Okay. Are we taking how, a long rest or a short how rest? How spacious is a bed? Uh, <laughs> Please well, do they, not get in with me! <laughs> Leave me alone! It probably fit two people. Fuck! I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to nap in bed. <laughs> I'm also going to climb in the bed. <laughs> Full armor. <laughs> I didn't ask for this cuddle bottle. You're gonna need a strength roll. Yeah. I'm gonna roll I only for need comfort. to rest for like four hours, so I'm gonna sleep yeah. for like four, and then I'm just gonna get up and. Ryan is a like hardcore sleep cuddler, by the way. <laughs> Why am I not fucking surprised? <laughs> Yo, you may not heal us health wise, but you heal us emotionally. There we go. Emotionally. <laughs> so I'm going to sit with my back to one of the beers and just finish the wine skin. <laughs> Sweet. So you're the most kind of looks at you with, <laughs> with disdain, but he's like, I understand. <laughs> you should you should have said you should have saw this coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go back to Farron quickly. Uh, so you're in this cave where there was a, a avalanche or rock slide it's a blizzard outside and you saw this one painting on one of the walls is there anything else you want to do uh, i'll investigate to see if there's a way through the rocks but if not then i'll head out of the cave okay or i'll actually i'll just wait out till the blizzard stops that's smarter okay i'll uh, just roll investigation Ooh, hey that's uh that's a 23 yeah, uh, you're able to find some rocks that are easy to move. Uh, you believe that eventually it it would take a while, but you probably could get through this section by creating like a digging it out. Okay. Um, then I'll put my my effort into digging that out. Okay. And I'll pull my water skin out when I need a nice sip of aqua. <laughs> Stay hydrated. <laughs> Uh, so after after like about an hour or so, you do dig a hole. Well, you do clear a hole that's large enough for you to get through. And are you going through it? Yeah, we'll go through it. Okay. Oh. And that's where we leave off on this episode. Oh, yo, man. Yo. <laughs> man.